you know what? You better save this footage. Better put it in the archives under the file rare. Because you never see Mr. News like this. You never see Mr. News flustered. You never see Mr. News angry. Oh. I've done things tonight. I've done things tonight that I wouldn't usually do. I attacked Chaz Phoenix back here. And I've just taken out both Martin Stallion and his local manager, Raymond Bethune. It's not what Mr. News does. It's not what I do. I'm professional. I'm the most professional man in the SWE. I do things the right way. Believe me, I didn't want to do this tonight. I didn't want to attack people left, right, and centre. But I was left with no choice. I was pushed. I was driven for far too long, for far too long. I've been getting screwed. I've been losing matches. I've been getting screwed out of matches. All I've been trying to do is do things the right way, win matches the right way. Give these, give these SW fans someone to be proud of, someone with honour, someone with integrity. But sometimes it seems a good guy doesn't get anywhere in this, in this business. Damn it! Oh! friends, Justin Crow here, just with a bit of a quick update for you, breaking news as we speak. I have just been informed that following his actions following his match with Chaz Phoenix here tonight at Dunblane, and following his actions after the Battle Royal, SWE management, that's Ted DiBiase himself, has actually indefinitely suspended Mr. News. For all the up-to-date information on this breaking story, it's facebook.com forward slash SWE online.